Hey YouTube, it's Doomboy439 here. How are you doing? Um, in this vid, I'll be showing you how to um, hatch baby stick insects. So this is the first video that I've done on stick insects. And this is my, if you've seen any of my other videos of my leopard gecko Lenny. Um, this was her old cage. She's now in that brown vivarium. I'll show you two girls in a minute. So yeah, so in here I've got one full male. Please. So let's just get her out. Um, it's really simple to breed them. But there she is. She's a twig. Yeah. Come on. Yeah, so it's really simple to breed them. Um, you don't need more than one because they will lay their eggs by themselves. Um, and loads of people say that you need to get right temperatures, right humidity, leave them. They're fine. Just p leave the eggs at the bottom of the, of the vivarium. And in about, I, I saw results in three months. There you go. She's livening up. Yeah, I saw results in three months, and they start off as a little ball. There's a little ball there. That's their eggs. This a brown ball with a little white dot on the end. Um, and yeah, in about three months, you'll start to see little babies. There's one just there. As you can see, I've got ten little babies so far. Or around ten. Even there. So my stick and six climbing all over me. Let's put you back. So yeah, all you um all you need is one female. Um, some eggs, a good setup. I'll show you how to set up the basic very minimum um, in one of my other videos. So yeah, just leave the eggs in the bottom of the vivarium about three months, um, then you'll start to see results. So they're quite hard to see. Because you can kind of see following his mum kind of like a stick. Oh, oh, look! So on my hand, out there, baby, yeah, tiny, really hard to spot. But I've seen ten so far. So yeah, thanks for watching. Please rate, subscribe, as well comment on any other videos that you'd like me to do. Thanks a lot. Bye.